process. So this is the hair here, and this one did come from Julia Hair. And this is a HD glueless wig right up my alley. It's 24 inches in length. And then I'll have any additional specs on this one in the description box. Let's try her on for size. Something I do, because my braids are not that flat, so I'll just take the um, elastic and I'll just lay it over the back of my braids to kind of help like press them down a little bit. I don't know if that necessarily helps, but what I will say that this one definitely fits glueless. A lot of the times a wig, even if it's your size, will just sit on your head. This one is a little bit tighter, but like not tight headache tight but like we don't have to bond anything down tight now you guys can see that cap there and that is where like the bod cap comes in we're not gonna do that instead let's take the wig back off and go ahead and add some color so i would add a foundation or concealer to the lace just so that to make sure that it is my color this is the maybelline fit me concealer and this is the or no 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 this is ruby kiss concealer and this is maybe maybelline fit me foundation This is even darker, so let's see if we add this on top. Okay, now that's much better. You cannot see the um, wig cap anymore. The hairline is beautiful. It is pre-plucked for sure. So we don't have to do any work there. And then I love the parting and how extended it is. Love the texture on this one. So maybe we should curl it. Maybe we should straighten it. Maybe we should wet it. Wet it. I think we're going to curl it. I did pick up a new curling iron. New but old. I think I already have one of these in this size. But mine are so dated. They're at least like maybe almost 15, 10 to 15 years old. So I did buy a brand new one from Target yesterday. For now, let's go ahead and do the install process. You guys already know how that goes, so I'm just gonna go ahead and add some music on top while we install, and we're gonna come back and curl the hair together. Someone else trying to forget And get you out of my head No I deleted all your messages Cause it only reminds me of the past But you're still trying Isn't it my birthday yet? Cause I gotta say, you're looking like a gift for me. Wrapped up nice and neat, baby. Get in my way now, don't be shy. We'll be here dancing day and night. Get in my groove now, don't be shy. Cause I got the system, my favorite things. You could be the part where it all begins. You could be the first and the second and the third and the rest of it.
step my game up When you bring my name up They gon' say I came up They gon' say I changed up Step my Same little nigga from the get-go Bet your bitch go for me I don't really need that shit though Please come get your shorty Teed up, gassed up, sick Go with my whip, go 40 Ay, ay I'm too cool for the rules, baby, get off of me Never need no push, I do it all for me Keep a couple real hitters, got them on call for me Money moving, got it in the market where it ought to be Too true for the flex, baby, don't cap to me Drop 50, bring 150 right back to me Keep a couple real hitters, got them on call for me Money moving, got it in the market where it ought to be Love you. Okay, ladies, so we are done with the look. This one did come courtesy of Julia Hair. Wanted to show you guys the packaging before I forget. And then so they gave me a pack of those wig caps. I told you these are my favorite currently, so I'm trying to find them online for purchase. They also gave this beautiful orange dust bag that does have their logo and all their information on it. And then they did give a melt belt at the bottom of the box. There's another pack of wig caps, which you guys seen I use, but inside of this little goodie bag that they also included. Um, it looks like we have another another wig caps another wig melt belt <clears throat> they were just being nice and generous um a pair of lashes and these are some good lashes and then a little kabuki brush and the hair itself was absolutely gorgeous to this moment i really wish i would have just kept it in its natural state um for me personally when it comes down to it you guys i mean i said it's like a broken record but i love me a closure wig especially if i can get five inches going back i love it when i can also I love it when I can also have the hair in like a natural wavy texture so I can just wake up and go. I can comb it out. I can spray it down with my water bottle from BeautyDagBeauty.com. Um, and usually like if I don't have the wig on, like when I'm getting out of the shower, I'll just take um, and hold the wig in my hand, spray it down real good so it can get not drenched but like saturated enough. I can throw a little bit of my mousse on top of that and be good to go. Comb it in and then just let it just hang in the back and it'll just wave up and do what it does. For the sake of, or for the sake of the tutorial, of course I wanted to give you guys some oomph. So I did go ahead and curl the hair. As I mentioned, I did get that new curling iron from um, Target and it is a Hot Tools brand one. Um, I've had that one. Um, at one point I had every size that Sally sold of the Hot Tools. It's called Hot Tools TM trademark. So um, I used to have like every single barrel and then I got into the bougier ones and decided these were peasantry and I got those. And now I'm realizing that in a lot of cases, those work better than um, the other brands. But this is the hair. Um, I did do a little bit of a pin curl. Um, the pin curls didn't work for me perfectly, but I did get a good curl out of them. Um, and it's because, I, like I said before, I need to practice. I don't really know how to use the, the, the pin curlers like I need to. And then also I should have probably been spraying them down with a little holding spray. Um, so this one is a glueless wig. I did take at some point when I was trying trying to um, make the hairline look a lot more natural. I did press a product in it. I just like to do that because I feel like it helps everything to look good and laid. But I wanted to remind you guys that this one does fit glueless. I just took my um, rat tail comb and pulled it through so you guys can see. Like it was, it's stuck down because it matches my, comp I mean because it's the right size and it's glueless. But it's not stuck down because I had added that spritz product. This is a glueless fitting wig and even with adding that product it still fits glueless. It's just now perfect because the baby hair is a little bit more melted because of that product. Anyways, I'm going to let you guys go. Of course, I can still go ahead and primp and do some more fun things with this one. And I definitely will. So yeah, go ahead and check out the description box. Why do I do that thing? Go ahead and check out the description box on your way out. You'll find a link to this wig as well as all the things we use in this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. And as always, I'll see you in the next one. Smooches.